Hey everybody, I'm Emily and this is Emmy Lou Arts and today I am going to swatch my new Jane Davenport watercolors. I sped this up because you've all seen a swatch video and these uh, watercolors aren't new so I know there's a ton of videos but I just got the new iPhone uh, 10X and or 10S 10S uh, yeah 10S <laughs> can you tell I'm not a technology person and I wanted to film on it and see if I saw a difference in the quality so you guys will have to tell me this color here, this is from the Jane Davenport uh, Brights palette that I got at Michael's, got it for Christmas. So that's Buzzy, the, the yellow. Ladybug is that really pretty pink color. And Butterfly is that really pretty, I'm just going to describe them all as really pretty. Um, blue, it's kind of a, more like an ocean, well, oh God, I suck at this. 70s eyeshadow was like a light sky blue. That mermaid is the green, um, and then the Jiminy is the lime green on the end, and then best friend, uh, all the way to the left on the bottom. Fairy tale is kind of a fuchsia -y pink. Frida is really pretty. Uh, it's like a deeper fuchsia. Mystic royal, and then ink. That ink is so pretty. I thought it was going to be black, but it's actually like a royal blue like a deep blue I've never seen um, a watercolor quite like it I really like it and then I decided to save the little packaging and put it in my journal um, just because I thought they were pretty <laughs> so I just put some double-sided tape in and I'm sticking in the uh, the little things that wrapped around the watercolors <clears throat> I really do like the quality of these so far I haven't done it on paper just here on those swatch cards that come in the tins but I really like them. Um, I'm excited for this phone. I'm hoping that it means um, better quality. I was using the uh, iPhone 6. <laughs> I went to Best Buy to upgrade and I've never felt so old in my life. There was two like teenage boys behind the counter and I was like, ah, I'm going to upgrade my phone finally, <laughs> you know, and we were joking around about it. And then he's like, okay, let me see your phone. And then, and I was like, okay, bye Zach Morris phone. We have now entered a generation who does not know who Zach Morris is. So <sighs> help us all, Lord. Um, this is the Glitzy palette. And that first color is Water Spirit. Oh, it's beautiful. It's like an olive green. Sylph is kind of a bright green. And then I'm going to butch butcher these names. Nereid, Nereid is another kind of royal blue, but it's deeper. These sea colors are kind of deeper. I love them. This next one is a red. It's Ariel. Really, really pretty. Um... Next after that is Frolicsome. It's a beautiful orange. It's kind of um like an ochre color. I wish I would have zoomed in closer for you guys, but um, Tresses is next, and it's yellow. It's very similar to Buzzy in the Brights palette. I would say those are, are pretty darn close. Um... I'm trying to compare them, the cards here, as I look. Those are the only two colors that I really think are sort of super similar. On the bottom row to the left is Best Friend. It's, or sorry, I'm looking at the Brights palette, is Sea Nymph. It's kind of um, a lighter blue, but it's, it's, it is different than Butterfly and 70s Eyeshadow in the Bright. So uh, Enchantress is um, like an emerald green, Lorelei another green, and Sea Mist another green. There is a lot of greens in this uh, glitzy palette, and they're just ever so slightly different. Um, so if you're not a big green person, uh, you're getting a lot of greens in this palette. Um, and then Flirtatious is very pretty. It's like a salmony color. And then Alchemy is like gold and I, if there's two shimmers in this and I'm not precisely sure which ones those are I think alchemy 
and now I can't tell. It's kind of hard to see. Um, but then I put these in my journal too. So, I mean, you don't really get a lot of repeats between the bright and the glitzy, um, but you do get a lot of greens in glitzy, but they're a deeper, deeper colors, but they're very beautiful. They really are. I would have liked to see like maybe one less green or two. There's four greens. Um, they are varying. So um, actually five, if you count water spirit, which is like an olive green. Um, so if you're looking for more pinks, I would go with bright, more greens and deeper. I would go with glitzy. I'm also putting these in my, in my, um, notebook. I just think they look so pretty. I love the bright colors. And then I can also, again, keep track because I put them in the order that they are in the palette. So I'm just using my uh, ballpoint pen to write Jane Davenport in kind of a scripty thing. And then glitzy. And then I pull out my, let's see, Tombow. I think this is the Fudenosuke calligraphy pen. Wow. And I'm just darkening up the downstrokes. This is my poor man's uh, calligraphy. That's how I cheat calligraphy. So <clears throat> if you ever want to know how to do calligraphy without knowing how to do calligraphy, just write cursive and then thicken up your downstrokes with a darker pen. And it sort of looks like hand lettering. I know not really, but <laughs> as good as I can get. And there's a picture of the cards. Let me know if you can see a difference in the, um, the quality. And thanks for watching, guys. Bye. Bye-bye.